the previous ones off oh, um, nice. so that I could do more videos. Okay, yeah. So which way did you turn when you come into Langley? Did you carry on going straight? Okay, exactly. Yeah, but you, you did it on your map yep. going from your place. Yes, I did from the old building yeah. to so here. So what I did, I come come to Smith's roundabout. I went straight across. Yeah. I turned into Langley. Yep. Yeah. And then, oh, then from there on, I should have gone straight on, turn right, no, turn left. Nope. Shit. Oh, <laughs> sorry. No. So oh, go Smith Motors. You go straight over the roundabout. Yeah. First left, yeah. which brings you into Langley. Yeah. Then it's the first right and right again. So you went right down to Pie Hill. <laughs> so, yeah, um, yeah, that's where you went wrong. No, I'll know it again. But it is, when I started going round, I saw all these big numbers. I thought, hang on, I'm going the wrong way here. And then I pulled up and there's a gentleman going out. Must have been your last customer. Yeah. And... Uh, I waited for him to come out. I thought yeah. it may have been your husband or something, but he's obviously a customer. Yeah. So when he came out, I pulled in, and that's it. I'm there. Pepsi, no, don't eat the hair. Don't. <laughs> She's never eaten hair before. Oh, well, sorry. You can keep them, them on. It's okay. No, it's all right. So did you have a good Christmas and New Year? No, I've been poorly, actually. Oh, wow. So, yeah. I've got a problem. My wife's had two new knees. Yeah. And uh, they've been done quite a while, but they're giving her a stick. I've had a hip and uh, another one done. Um, but I've also got this problem where my, I'm diabetic. Yeah. And uh, I've got a problem where it builds up pressure in, in my body. Yeah. And it comes out with blisters everywhere. Mm -hmm. It's called uh, Om Omaha Omaha. Ben ben oh, I can't it know. comes out like ulcers, doesn't it? No, well, it's not. It's it's. I'll bet I'm having treatment for it, but yeah. you think it goes. Yeah. But then it appears in another part of your body, like your legs or your feet. Yeah. And it, it's just like uh, water blisters. It's not catching by the way. No, no, no. I used to get them or... um, uh, when, like, my um, diabetes was not, when it was acting up, I could literally peel the skin off of my yeah. fingers. Yeah. Because I'd have all underlying blisters yeah. as well. Yeah, it, yeah, it does. It comes on here. Yeah. But I only ever got it on my hands. Oh, dear. Oh, yeah. Oh. But when I was on um, metformin. Ah, that's, that's what I'm on. Uh, my whole tongue was one big blister. Oh, God. Um, I had all ulcers in my mouth. Yeah. Um, and they tried me on a um, couple of other diabetic medications. And one of them actually felt like it was burning a hole in my stomach. Oh. Um, stop it, Pepsi. Um, so then while I was at the doctor's, they would give me like a quarter of a tablet. And I had to wait there half an hour because two yeah. tablets I went into anaphylactic shock with. Oh. So, um, yeah, so then that, they just went, yeah, we can't give you anything else. Um, they tried to give me some aspirin to try and take the pain away from my stomach. And um, I went into anaphylactic shock oh, with that God. as well. So, yeah, mm. I, every time my notes come up, it all automatically flashes red. Previously on um, so that's why I went straight onto insulin. Okay. Um, yeah, it's it's really weird. Well, it's been like this for ages. Uh, last January started. Really? And we were going on holiday. And I went in to see the specialist. Yeah. And he said, oh, well, I'll give you some ointment. You'll be all right. Uh, he told me what it was. I couldn't pronounce it. I still can't pronounce it after a year now. Anyway, um, we were off on a cruise. And we were going to um, the Caribbean, and he said, I'll give you some ointment um, and some pills, he suggested. Yeah. 
and it's to do with your diabetes. You know, you yeah. anyway gets over there and it just blew up. It absolutely blew up with blisters all over my arms, my legs, and everything. Wow! So I went to the shop to the doctor and she knew exactly what it was. And she said, when we land in or sail into um, know, Antigua, I think it was. Hmm? We'll get you off the ship and get you to see a specialist. Anyway, she did it all for me, got a taxi, me and the missus went off, dropped in at this, I mean, really, literally, Lisa, it was as big as this place here. Yeah. No, no disrespect to you, but I mean, I thought it was going to hospital, but it was, a, anyway, this lady came in, come into my office, or went in, and she said, just I know where it is, this Polaris, about Pentagoid, or Pentagoid is called. Yeah. Um, she said, I'll give, I'll get you some treatment from the local chemist, and you, if you go up there, I said, where, where is it? He said, it's only just down the road. Anyway, I managed to get there, cost me about 500 quid. Wow. But we were insured, obviously, so I yeah. wasn't worried about that. And I kept taking these things, but for sort of a month or so, or whatever we were on the ship, it was terrible. Couldn't go out anywhere. I was embarrassed because, you know, obviously people see you, they wonder if you're carrying something, you know, yeah. bad. And, um, and it's been like that since. I see a blood specialist about every 12 weeks and he's increased my tablets because um, you get terrible itchy, you know, you know what I mean? Yeah. And he's increased my tablets. But when he first increased it, about... 12 weeks before my last no. visit, I just couldn't, I, I was going around the bend, I was having dreams and all yeah, sorts of all things going on in my mind, and uh, I went to see him, I said, I can't cope, he said, all right, I'll reduce them back to where you were, and, and this time, he, he, he said, it seems to be clearing up, Yeah. so I want you to put two, two in the morning, two at night, and one of the others, in the morning so and one at night. Yes. So that's how many is that eight, nine, ten tablets, plus all my metformin and all my bit I take about nineteen pills a week a day. And you're probably on the same. Um I think with all my medication I think I take Throughout the whole day, I take about 32 tablets. Yeah, you're about you really the same. Yeah. <laughs> in the morning, I take... Um, I take 19 tablets in the morning. You take you, you take the white ones, the two in the morning, metformin. No, I don't take metformin. Oh, I'm allergic to it. They weren't agreeing with you. Yeah. yeah. No, I have, maybe. I, mean, I have insulin. Do you know what annoys me? I've just got uh, a, a doctor who came on to me, but I couldn't get get to the phone quick, you know. Yeah. And when I went in, it was so, oh, William, you've got a, you make appointment for your annual, um, the annual physical, my annual um, diabetes check. Mm -hmm. So goes into the app, wants your name, your name and number and, and your uh, telephone, uh, your uh, date of birth and all that, put all that in, continue, there's no appointments available. And they asked me to go in and make an appointment, so how the hell does that work? I have no idea. No. I know one thing, when I went to um, America uh, in 2004, I got, I was wearing um, like a beach, a beach dress, but I had a tank top underneath it, so because I was so hot, and I got burned here oh, through my clothes. I got burned, and um, I went to the hotel and I just said, "Is there anything you can go, or is there a chemist?" Uh, and they just went, "Oh no, you can go to the drugstore." Uh, oh. so, okay, where is that? Yeah. Who's on International Drive? They directed me to it, and I just said, oh, "Can I speak to the pharmacist, please? Um, I'm diabetic and I've got a big burn, and it literally had blistered." And he said, well, ideally you need to go to the hospital. And it's like, yeah, I don't want to go to the hospital. No. And not just for us, not for sunburn. And he goes, well, it's a little bit more than sunburn. It's like, but is there anything you can do for me? Is there any cream? I'm diabetic. 
<laughs> and I'm oh, itching like anything. No, yeah. And he goes, okay, come back in 20 minutes. So I had to give him all of my, you know, like when you get your repeat prescription yeah, slips. Yeah, so I gave yeah. them all, so he knew yeah. what I was taking. Yeah. He came back and he goes, right, I need you to rub this on. Where it's blistered and everything, I need you to rub it on. And he goes... It's going to hurt, but you've got to rub it on. Have a shower, come out, rub it on again, and literally you're going to be screaming, but you've got to do it. Okay. And he goes, and in the morning, just put ordinary sun cream on. i done it, literally, I was dancing. It was hurting that much. And I was going to mom, I've got to take it off, I've got to take it off. And she goes, no, no, leave it on. Um, I left it on, done, followed the instructions, I woke up the next day, there was no blister, no nothing. You're gone. It had gone. It had literally gone. I kid you not, it had gone. So it didn't hurt anymore? Nope. Good God. I had like a little ripple. You know, like when you burst a blister, you got that little. That's all I had. Yeah, I know. Um, but my mum's going. What are you wearing Which today? I said, I'm wearing uh, I'm wearing my dress, I'm wearing a cardigan. Yeah. And she goes, okay, I'm blowing me up, I'm blowing on my back through a cardigan. <laughs> and it was like, so I used the same cream again. And it was like, oh. Mom was going, what factor are you wearing? I was like, I'm wearing factor 50. Yeah. And I was still burning. And it was like, I, I tell you what, I'm going to put on factor 50 and I'm going to put it on every half an hour. And I set my phone. Every half an hour, I was applying it rather yeah. than every yeah. hour. And I came home because Michael had to work. I came home and he goes, You look really dirty. And it's like, What do you mean? And he goes, You look dirty. And the, the tan that I got made me look dirty. All oh, right. And it was like, Oh. So it didn't go brown. It got no. very dark brown. No, oh. it just made me look dirty. Like all my freckles came out. Oh, God. And um, yeah, I just look, I look like I haven't washed my face in about a month. Oh. He goes, Is this you with a town? And like, we've been together, well, we've been married for like 10 years by then. Oh. He goes, You've not washed your face all, the whole time you've been in America. And it was like, Of course I did. I had showers. Yeah. But it was a very, it was, it was, the, it was the sunburn. Sun tan, yeah. yeah. Sun tan, yeah. And like, I always wear a big floppy hat as well. So that was America, was it? That was America, yeah. Well, we haven't, we haven't been since. We, I must admit, I, I've seen Tambra, this uh, blood specialist. I think this is my fifth visit. And uh, he's up my tablets. But it's like a guessing game, you yeah. know? And I said, look, I'm not being rude, but there must be somebody with this problem. He yeah. said, yeah, I see several people. Well, has, there, has anybody got anything and it's made them better? And he said, yes, but he said, what you've got to remember is that you're a different case. You've got um, diabetes, they haven't, or they had, and it, it comes out in a different form. Yeah. So these blisters, what happens when they come out? He said, well, he said, just get your wife to get a little needle and just burst them. It was literally as, you know, when the trouble is, like you were saying with, with the skin on, it, it just went all over the place. Yeah. And when you rubbed it, it peeled off. Yeah. And you've got a red mark there for three months. Yeah, easy. easy. I mean, like, I've got blister coming up yeah. there. Yeah, oh dear. So it's just, yeah. Yeah. I think that's just one of the things we have to deal with when we're yeah. diabetics. Uh, well, that is my problem. I, I'll tell you, I'll take that actable. Because uh, it's for um, you know diabetes thing. Yeah, it's full of good bacteria, isn't it? Yeah, and uh, there's some pills you can take. I think the D D sixes or something like that, uh, which he recommended. You take one a day. Okay. Keep doing all that business, and I must admit, it's not as bad. You think it's gone, and you wake up in the morning and you think, oh, that's good. And then in the afternoon, it starts itching again. Yeah. It starts coming back again. Um, I'm absolutely peed up with it, to be honest. I don't know what to do. I'm 86 now. Yeah. And I'm thinking, how long is it going to go on for, you know? 
Yeah. Anyway, yeah. Oh, we do it. Yeah, quick glasses back on. I'm finished now. I'm just going to show you the back. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Just Is that okay? Yeah, that's all right. Everything's okay. He's on my eyebrows. I did do your eyebrows, yeah. Yeah, he's on everything. Love a juggle. Yeah. yeah, it's sticking up a bit, isn't it? But it's the same length. Yeah, it's all right. It's all right. Do you want any wax or gel one? No. No? There you go. Yeah, okay, lovely.